of the course going to be talking about scattered points uh, uh, which is going to we're going to be doing on a plotting x y and uh, x and y axes so now uh, we're going to first in, in construct and interpret the scatter point plots or points in this case whatever so we have uh, to go to uh, definitions here first of all what's a, sc a scatter plot for example look at this uh, points here that means we have a time we have a number of uh, new views for example so we say well uh, when when the time is two we have the say from around around 350 when the, the time is four uh, that means we have like around 150 so we, we're plotting points on this and you can see that the, the, the dots are not exactly on a line but you can see that they're going down so that means uh, we can get an idea that if, with time, uh, the number of views is going to go down. Okay, so that's the idea. So it's what we call negative. Uh, we'll talk about it. negative association. Yes. So now, if we, if it's if it, the points are pointing up, for example, with we, like let's say we, when we move to the right on the x-axis and and uh, the y-axis actually giving us a value that is higher every time, that's a positive association. So uh, a cluster is when you see all, most of the points are close to each other. Notice that this point by itself here, that's what we call an outlier. Okay, outliers means it's outside the group. So there's something weird, either the numbers are wrong or uh, something went wrong. We, we, never, we never know. So, you know, we, we'll, we'll investigate it when we are class. Now we can see there's a gap between the scattered points because how come all of them almost the same in the same area and this is by itself outside. So that's why they call it outlier. Okay. So now, Look at this one. This one is not even, you know, it's in, in the right way. So the, the values here are up and down. So we, this is not a linear kind of uh, relationship here. Uh, if you could draw a line that goes from here to here, you could see probably I could, could catch some of those uh, dots or plots. Uh, here's a, cl a cluster where, where most of them, they're, they're gathering around each other. Uh, a gap is between, between the outlier and the cluster point. And this is not even, there's no association here. Okay, yeah, you took it, you're talking about a positive association, you're talking about negative association, and here's no, completely there's no association, so you can say positive or negative. All right, so now we continue with the next section, for example, here, the linear, uh, analyzing linear association, so that's what's more important. So we can see that if there's a point, points here, we could draw a line that almost goes in the middle between them, so we can see that there's a, uh, uh, a line that may this is what we call a trend line okay so we could use different names by the way every time we use a different name and then depends on the books that we're we using so that means this is what we're doing okay that's uh, non-linear and linear so you can see this is, uh, here non-linear association so there's association but it's not linear in, in a way uh, strong positive weak positive so notice that if I draw a line, most of the, my dots are closer to, to my line. Here you can see that dots are a little bit far away from, from the line. That means it, it, there is a positive thing because we are going up, but except it's a weak. Here you can see that it's tilted here. That means it's not linear. Okay. So, uh, and we're going to keep doing this till the end of the, this chapter, by the way. That's, it's going to be a lot, almost like repeated. You know, and then we're going to find out the slope of this one. So you can see the slope is going down. Uh, that means it's a negative, okay? The slope is going up, that means it's positive. And uh, the section, by the way, this chapter has uh, five sections in it. And you can see the relationship between all of them, okay? So probably we could do more than one thing at the same time. Okay, guys, that's it. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.